This is the Western Hedgehog. There are three types of hedgehogs in Europe, and this is the only one that inhabits the British Isles. Hedgehogs are characterised by their covering of spines, which can grow up to three centimetres long, and short, sturdy, dark legs. They're familiar animals in parks and gardens. They're largely nocturnal and like to hibernate in nests of dry grass and leaves. Their natural habitat is in lowland grasslands and open woods. In the wild, the most important invertebrates for hedgehogs are worms, beetles, slugs, caterpillars, earwigs, millipedes. As well as these, they also eat a wider range of insects. However, if you have hedgehogs in your garden, it is advisable to feed them meat-based cat food or dog food. However, you do not want to feed them fish, mealworms, unsalted nuts, sunflower hearts, leftover cooked meats, chicken being one of their favourites, and sultanas and raisins. Hedgehogs give birth in June and July, and they have an average litter size of four or five young. However, they only usually wean two or three of these successfully. This particular hedgehog is a female and she's stocking up on food for when she gives birth to her young. After a big meal, she sleeps for a while to regain her energy and strength to carry on walking and foraging for more food. female hedgehog often slows down and stops for a minute to regain her energy for the walk through the foliage. She's probably carrying up to six hoglets in her womb. Nevertheless, she still has to carry on foraging. You may have noticed the white bumps in her ear. They're ticks. They will probably fall out within a week or so.
bushes provide the perfect cover for the hedgehog while it's walking and hunting. Hedgehog eyesight compared to human eyesight is very limited. Therefore, they rely on their sense of smell and their sense of touch to navigate their way through the woodland. However, hedgehogs have gone through a massive decline through the past two decades, and it's now likely that the hedgehogs will be on the UK endangered list within five years' time. So remember, it is our responsibility to help preserve these prehistoric creatures. Thank you.